the adventures of Curie and Thomas continue. It's great for you all to join me. We are currently in the shadow of what oh, once was. The Commonwealth is so full of history. Yeah, for independence or the castle as it's called. Still has some defensive positions from ye old days of Preston. Let's explore this place, why don't we? a lot of XP. I know using the grenade to kill them all was just one of them things you just gotta do. Search through all this. Oh, Flamer. Uh, see, I probably should have emptied all my stuff before doing this. Oh, hello. Come on, get some. <laughs> Tell you what, at the size of them, they'd be bigger than your hand. Like, I wouldn't want to. Wouldn't want to see a few of them. There's a few stogies. Thanks, Curie, for telling me I'm just still alive. If, albeit barely. And I think I've already given you a lot of stuff, so there's not much more we can carry. Uh, nope. Just, do you know how it's worth it? Apparently, I didn't get the XP for it. Cams. Oh, it's a bed. Oh, I could sleep here for a bit. Hey, hey. That would be useful. Nothing nasty, I hope, in here. Nope, there is something. I suppose that's one. Why is most of this episode just been me smacking hatchlings? That's what it feels like. And I'm not complaining. Okay. You know what? We'll have a sleep and we'll tell Preston we're taking the castle. May as well bring him in for it all. Why not? In fact, instead of sleeping, I have a better idea. We could just teleport back. So I'll return to the castle with Preston. And let's let's do this. Look at the two of us here in sanctuary, prepared for the future. You're uh -oh. tied to this place, kid. Your energy. I never really speak to Mama Murphy. I used to live here a long time ago. Ah, but the distant past ain't so distant for you. I saw you leave that ice box. This whole world is like some bad dream you can't wake up from, isn't it? The site can help you, kid. It always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can see what it wants to tell you. Here. Already have some. Like a little kick yourself, huh? This'll do. Now, Let's see where this let goes. me ride the high to where the site wants to take you. You're on the trail of the man who took your boy. I see a house locked up tight. Chains put on by a smiling shark. Uh -huh. But there's another way. I can see it. Ah, this was Kellogg's house. Key. Lost and forgotten. Fallen down below. Search the chairs beneath the house. They hold the secret. 
Phew. Wow. That took more out of me than usual. I'm gonna need to rest now, kid. I know I'm not the only person here who's lost someone. Ma'am. I just got a favor to ask you, kid. I miss him so much. I know it's silly, but I need a chair. Something with a nicer fit for these old bones. Can you do that for me? Sure. Be glad to help. Thank you. Well, you willing to do some work? What kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. I know this is like 50 episodes too late, <laughs> but... I'd be glad to help. Okay, good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Okay, um, we, well, we are going to take the castle. I'm sorry, I, I, I wouldn't be very good company right now. So... You're connected to the main thing. So, let's see. Well, guessing in here would be good enough. And you're in here. Noted. Murphy's chair. Look, 10k steel. Wood. Just so much. Uh, Mama Murphy, you can just kind of just, I would imagine, just chilling out here. Kind of place I'd imagine you'd be. Uh, sort of beds now for these guys. Just. We will do better. But uh, do you know what? I can give you a nice, nice start. Can you move? You know what? Since we talked, I'm feeling swell. Yeah. Well. Look at the two of us here in Sanctuary. Prepared for the future. Is that the right way? Given the lack of space, is it probably do best with like a steamer trunk? Or maybe just some suitcases kind of roughly stacked. That looks good to me. Okay, in here, I could probably make you look a bit nicer. Right, put you a bit snugger than that. And then what I can do is containers. I can throw down gun case. No, I definitely passed gun cases. There we go, foot lockers. There you go. See? Looking much nicer already. Turn this into a bit of a meeting area. This is just to get through the whole Sturges thing, so... Don't worry. Sorry, no. Would it be awesome given the circumstances? Yeah.
bear with me. Bear with me a wee sec. And I have an idea. I'm cooking something. watch TV. This sounds like good, good idea to me. Uh, in terms of defense though, we need some power. That's the first thing we need. Luckily, the rank one that sounds, we can build a large one. On rank four, we'll be able to get these. And once I'm able to build a load of fu fusion reactors, I think one of them will basically do every settlement. Um, can you like come down to the ground, please? I had no choice. It took so many of them to kill just one. There's seven people, so I need more beds. Okay, well, we'll just. Again, let's just finish up in here. This looks like a swell place, so this was my place. There we go. Plenty of beds. Alright. Sturges, we'll talk to you. Talk to Mom Murphy. Kind of just clean up a bit we'll of this. find what you're looking for. I know it. Mama Murphy. I'm alright, kid. Just need to oh, take so it easy before take you lose okay. any sight. I actually want to move you. know you. what? Since we talked, I'm feeling swell. Look at the two of us here in Sanctuary. Prepared for the future. No. What is happening here? Hey, now that you're back here in Sanctuary, how would you like a job? A job? For me? Really? Sure, let me just stop what I'm doing to talk to you. I'm being sarcastic. Leave me alone. No, no, where is Sturgis? I can't talk to him through the window. Ah, serious? <laughs> oh, trying to cheat it that way. I like it. 
Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. I'm on it. Clean water coming up. <sighs> Great. Uh-huh. Do you know what? Just in the... In the midst of all this, I have an idea. Because we did unlock something a bit OP. The mighty industrial water purifier. Five par for 40 water. I reckon that these terrible eyesores will be magnificent. <laughs> Still eyesores. Well, magnificent eyesores. Providing a hundred and sixty water. What? How much was it to make them? Oil, ceramic, rubber, copper, steel, cloth, screw. One cents. Five. It gets pretty good. Actually, really good. Now you've got more water than anyone in the Commonwealth. Just to make sure everyone filled out their forms. I was supposed to win a pack of steak knives. <laughs> I like having him around. He's funny. I feel better already, knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help, but our food... Eh, if we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. I'll start planting right away. Good deal. Okay, food, I guess, I guess we're rebuilding sanctuary this episode. The king. The king of crops. we assign someone to it. Marcy's not doing anything, so... Ah. Oh, I did assign her. I'm assigned to the chair. I knew Sturgis would find something to keep you busy. Now this place is starting to feel like home. Awesome. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go with this. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we... What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able... Sure. What sort of defenses did you have in mind? Walls, sandbags, turrets, whatever you can put together. You know what? Since we... Sturgis. Talk... Thanks I'm for doing that. Swell. Well, I'll sleep better Look at night at knowing we have. It's been a long road. Sanctuary. Yeah. Prepared I think this is it. For the future. Oh. Feels good. What next? Well, I guess figuring out how to get back to living instead of just surviving. Right. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door's always open to you. Windows, too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. Sanctuary complete. Now, 
Where is Prest? Where the heck did he end up? All the way down here. He was just standing there. Hey. Do you think we're ready to retake the castle? I took care of the raiders that were harassing that settlement you sent me to. The people there have decided to join our cause. That's great news. One day, we'll be strong enough to drive that scum out of the Commonwealth for good. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. Hey. Do you think we're ready to retake the castle? Yeah, we'll retake it now. Yeah, let's do this. We'll do some recon and meet you outside the castle. See you there. It'll be good to have some help. For what we're doing. As for the purified water situation, well, that's just got a wee bit insane. Plus, Sanctuary's a bit happier. As is Abernathy and the Red Rocket. Everywhere around by, everywhere nearby is relatively happy. So, let's go to Red Rocket, grab a few things, deposit most of my items, and go retake the castle. Now we're ready. Now we've all gathered in here. Lovely. Everyone's here, General. There it is. Pretty impressive, huh? Its real name is Fort Independence, but the many men always just called it the castle. Now you can see why I wanted to take it back. Definitely. For 600 years old, it's in pretty good shape. That's right. They don't make them like they used to. We take this place back, people will know we mean business. Mm -hmm. Our primary objective is to clear the courtyard. That's where we should see the most opposition. The wall on this side is the most exposed. But if we circle around south, we could also reach the main gate. What are we waiting for? Let's just get in there and shoot those lobsters. No. If we split up, we can flank them from both sides. It'll be like shooting fish in a barrel. Why not let them come to us? We set up a firing line on this side and you can draw them out. Well, General. Let's not overcomplicate this. Just get in there and hit them with everything we've got. If you say so. All right, people. You heard the general. Let's move out. Try not to draw their attention until we're in position. In position? I mean, like... Is it not just guns blazing? No? Right, come on, Preston. You're not getting out of this. This should be pretty easy with Lucky 38 here. Bish, bash, bosh, just straight through them all. Uh, <clears throat> we got this, General. I do like being called General. Like they've been nesting. We're gonna have to take out these eggs, or they'll be back. Yes. <laughs> Plasma, the weapon of tomorrow. Before we know it. Lurks like to hole up inside old buildings, so the walls are probably full of them. Sure looks that way. Here's how we're gonna play this. You hold here in the courtyard and take care of any eggs you find. The general and I will clear the walls. Yes, sir. Let's do this, general. The delicious ones. <laughs> ah. Oh, that's nice. Be good if we were specializing against mutants. What the hell was that? <laughs> And take this and this and that. What? Where's the queen? Over here. Here we go. We 
We're not done clearing the eggs. of you. Clear out any remaining Myrlurks or eggs you find. That's what we look at, Sam. I think I got something over here. Let's do this! Okay, so we need to power it up. Yeah! We are being shot at. I'm not sure. Can? Oh. Let's go see if there's anything left of the old transmitter. I can't believe we actually managed to take that thing down. Well, I guess it could be worse. See what you can do with it. Once I power this I'm up, gonna go see what we'll else be ready to broadcast. Old place. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. stuff right, what do I need for tan I need right, well, I'm not getting any of that oh do enough for this though Did it. I've been watching the men and men fall to pieces for so long, I just... This is really something. Now we've got to pay off on what we've started. Bring the whole Commonwealth together and make it last this time. So, you know, back to business. But with Radio Freedom up and running, we can broadcast alerts to you anywhere, anytime. Which reminds me, I've got another trouble spot for you to check out. I'll mark it on your map. We can use all the support we can get. So, see what you can do to help. Tampines again? What about the basement? This is Radio Freedom, broadcasting all day, all across <coughs> the Commonwealth. Is there something you need? All quiet here. Stay tuned for... How are you feeling? I'm glad to have the chance to return the favor. After all the help you gave me. Anything else? No. No. All right. How do I get into the basement? That's what I want to know. Like, there was zero discussion about it. Anyway. Now that that's sorted. Hmm. What do you next? I'll go to the General Atomics Factory. Go from there. Oh. I have some time. I have spent much effort gathering information in our travels so far, and my cell diagnostics have come to a green conclusion. It is not lack of data or lack of collaboration which stifles my scientific progress. The inescapable truth is there has never been a great robot scientist. I'm sure your research isn't that bad. You are polite to say this, but if something does not change, my efforts will be mere stagnation. The greatest scientific minds of history, the Einsteins and the Curies, my namesake, have had something beyond raw data analysis capabilities. They have had a spark. This elusive inspiration is something I must possess. Okay. If there's a way you can do that, you should. In fact, I must. If I am to advance my understanding of medicine in this strange world, I must embark on a great adventure. I must become human, or as close as I can. I must find a way to download all that I am into a human brain. What? I know someone who might be able to help. Dr. Amari. Please, 
Then we must go to her and talk. Perhaps this is an impossibility, but it must be pursued. Emergent behavior. Wow, every quest I complete. There's more rust devils. I haven't seen you in ages. I'm actually really thankful. You wouldn't believe the stuff I've been through since the last time. Oh, shit. Should have enough carry weight to do me for this next bout of adventure that we're about to embark on in uh, the old place here. After which, I think the best thing to do would be to do dance, like get him into the picture in the Brotherhood and do quests for them as well. First, this factory. Did you hear something? I don't think we're alone here. any of the big creep bots. Ow! Yes! Oh, ho ho! Energy weapons. What is plasma anyway? A cool magazine. Got that uh, curry downstairs in a little bit. Too long with a pop. Ooh, excellent. Yes. Ooh, what's this? An ID card. Can kids. Personal logs, job assignment. Congratulations on your promotion, Mr. Kincaid. Uh, we hope your transition from the factory goes smoothly. As the on-site human supervisor of the General Atomics Galleria, you will be helping to pioneer a new shopping experience for the expanding General Atomics customer base. We assure you that this will be a comfortable job and require very little effort or stress on your part. Your responsibility will be to simply observe the operations of the completely automated staff, we expect very little intervention will be required on your part as the robotic staff have undergone testing before being deployed. Thank you for your service to the company. I put in years of my life to keep this factory running and this is how they treat me. I'm supposed to babysit set a bunch of robots while they play shop. This is ridiculous. They don't think I can see what this really is. Ageism. I can still do my job as well as any 25 year old, but they all tell me, Mr. Kincaid, it's time to retire. Mr. Kincaid, you should travel. Mr. Kincaid, you should spend more time with your family. While I don't want any of those things, I want to sit here and run this factory like I have for years. This job will kill me. I am literally going to be bored to death, and it'll be their fault. Nice. Oh! He still had me read the turret, or the terminal. I can appreciate that. Ow! Yeah, where'd Curry go? She's just... Oh, repair. Look alive. What do you want? Memos! Let's see. With the launch of the new Miss Nanny model, customers will be attempting to bring defective units to the factory for repairs. In this situation, please gently remind the customer that warranty program agreement states that defective units must be shipped through the proper channels before being accepted for repairs. Customers may be frustrated, but assure them that satisfaction is the absolute priority of General Atomics. Also take this opportunity to tell them about our new quality assurance wing that will minimize the amount of defective units that leave the factory floor in the first place. As a receptionist, you are the first face of any client uh, or our client C, so make sure it's a friendly one. 
Mr. Kincaid prefers a cappuccino, extra foam, no sugar. Mr. Smith, latte, skim milk, three spoonfuls of sugar. Damn. Black coffee, absolutely no sugar or milk. And Mr. Kaloon, uh, coffee with two packets of half one, of half and half, one sugar. Not bad. I normally take mine with honey and a bit of milk out of a cafeteria. Yeah, that's that's the kind of operation. That's the type of ship uh, that I'm running over here. Music to stop. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. I'm I'm not gonna lie, I was in disbelief that quantum bot was just rinsing me like that. I also appear to have injured myself at some point. Ow! How did I manage that? Oh, I must have scraped against the door. Damn, that hurt. Oh, this isn't the start of it again, right? We'll get all the way up that quantum bot. Now, I've got the high ground on it this time. I was just missing most of my shots. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> no, no, no. Where is this final bomb? Uh, and there's stairs over here, so. I think I'll take great pleasure out of doing this. It's like a robo brain. It is a robo brain. Okay. Gilbert, which is what we really so let's grab some of this. Make it a wee bit easier to haul this stuff away. Ooh, I hear a generator. Oh, there's something above us.
do I get upstairs? Sounds like a fusion generator. Which means. Why not? Disk file. <laughs> That's it. obvious way. Oh ho, no there is more. We've also leveled up twice. Oh damn. I didn't even notice. Right. Do you know what? I kinda want more I just want more strength and carry more about. Nothing really nothing else really tickles my fancy. Or not damn might be a better solution. Uh, let's see. Cam resistant. See, so we take one more into this, we can actually get our explosives to do more. Uh, we'll take a point in uh, strength just to get us up. So now we're. Uh, 440 in the carry weight department. Should have actually took some rad resistance for the glow and see. Ah! We'll get around with that. No. Thanks for lock terminal. I wonder what you do. was a good guess. Mm-hmm. Oh, you are on the terminal again. What? What on earth was the point of that? Must be for a quest later down the line or something. Doesn't make a lot of sense. Doesn't make any sense. I have to do a wee quick Google on that. Nice. Why? Why is there such a beefy terminal with nothing on it and a disappearing metal box? Why is this whole factory so weird? Else seems strange or startling. Oh, maybe open that door, but there there is things behind it. I just there doesn't seem to be an obvious way to open this. Huh. Oh no, there is an upstairs to this bit. Must be a terminal about. You can't get in there. It has to be. There's something I'm not missing. There's something I'm missing here. Where have we quick once over? Well, you will not believe it. This place is a little strange. So there's an expert lock terminal that does nothing, and there's a door here that would need to be opened by a terminal, and you can't. But there's a right away in a coffee cup behind it. 
that obviously we're never going to be able to get. That's that's pretty wild. Yeah. That's strange. You don't see too much of that throughout the game. But that's us. Let's head out here. Here's a bit of a blast from the past. <coughs> Leave me in peace. I need to mourn my father. Yeah, well, I kind of need you to give me the item that you promised me, Jack. Well, managed to unbug it. I just went inside and I kind of dragged his father's body about for a bit. So, well, Lorenzo, yeah, it wasn't the best end for him. But we got the artifact gun and, uh, more importantly, the quest completed. He just said, here you go. So, yeah. Sounds sweet to me. And now that we've done that, we can get out of here. Do something else. Maybe uh, speak to Dr. Amari about Curie. Might be our next uh, place to visit. Hate when things are bugged though. Anyway, he did mention about a, mo or a city buried underneath the Mojave, an alien city. I wonder what that would be in reference to. It's a curious one. I think, personally, there's a New Vegas 2 coming. If not a New Vegas 2, a remastered New That's Vegas, where they'll bring in a load of aspects from number 4 and all and just expand on it. I mean, who would turn down if you kept the basis of, or the basics of New Vegas and then threw in all the extra stuff? Which is why I think they might do a number two. Whoa. I keep forgetting when I actually. I but, who surrounded who there? Hmm? Alright, Kyrene, let's go talk to Dr. Amari about your, uh, your issues. No quests up this direction. What's this? Speak to Ada. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We'll do that first. I actually forgot I put Ada here. Wow, there's a lot of you. I'm relieved to see you've returned. Were you able to find anything at General Atomics? I found this strange device on a robot. Let's have a look. Impressive technology. If my analysis is correct, this is a specialized radar beacon. I suspect it's how the mechanist was keeping track of the robo-brain you destroyed. As the next logical step, I need you to install this beacon within me so we can use it to our advantage. Sounds like a solid plan. I'm glad you agree. You'll need to use a robot workbench to ensure proper installation. In order to maximize our time efficiency, perhaps I should accompany you now. I'll get you later. Very well. I'll be... Easy work in this aim. Ada. A pleasure to see you again, sir. Are you ready to depart? Time to hit the road. Understood. Right. So send her quickly there. Bye. Hey. What can I do for you? New orders, sir. I think it's about time we called it. I'd prefer to remain. Uh, we'll send you now to start out driving. Uh huh. A dangerous look about you. Hope you ain't here today. Do you make. need something, monsieur? I'd like to travel together some more. Then let us get on their way. Okay, well that's progressed. Uh, Ada, a wee bit further. Talk to the settlers at Ten Pines Bluff. You know what, we'll walk over them. Why not? See this raider's respawned up here? Or does he respawn? No, he just despawned. <gasps> yes! Violence! This way! I don't even think there is anything here. It's just sort of middle of nowhere. But there was an explosion. Something done that. Sentry dot. Sentry sentry dot. I don't want to drop down from here. It looks like quite the uh, quite the fall. took you out man business and I don't think they did they go all the way around <laughs> I 
<laughs> All of that. Oh, it's because Ada was walking back. Ah, and she attracted all the settlers. The random gunner sentry bot that's dead, I don't know much about that though. That is a wee bit strange. But, we sounds full of strange things, isn't it? Wish you could have zipped around in one of them. It would have been silly, but, ah, just give me, give me silly things like that. The modders are going to do it anyway, I suppose, so. There's a wee provisioner. Must be the one that goes over to. Did we take the power armor out of this? We did. Well, I guess it's up the crew's bridge. Up to the crew's bridge. That was actually one of the first times I started naming the unmarked locations myself. Um, I've come up with some wonder names. Even more wonderful reasons as to why they're there. The story building elements are quite wild at times. Ah yes, my wind turbine, my very green, my green town. Hope you all enjoyed the settlement building earlier. There will be a few Got more work episodes to do. like that. Now. <gasps> Lucas, my armor saved many a wastelander. Let's see what you've got. What you see is what you get. Okay, I've 8,000 and you carry the Manta stuff, which is still worth Hi. Hi, Lucas. Is it worth Lucas, that much? Best way to spend your I have no idea of all armor. the perks of everything. Let's see what you've got. And you want to charge me 7,000 for an arm guard. And one agility and perception. Anything else? Boo. I might have actually sold that to him. I can't, I can't fully remember. I don't think I did. Don't really shadow my little helmet. Yeah, nah. Don't know anything from Earl Lucas there, but we will chat to these guys. Rob's been growing pretty good lately. Excuse me. You're with the Minutemen, right? The Minutemen are always happy to help. What did you need? A pack of feral ghouls is holed up nearby, and some of them have started wandering out. If more of them start wandering out this way, we may be overrun. I'm on it. It's as good as done. I'll be glad to have him gone. I don't... Do you know what? I could totally do this. Get back to Diamond City what? one of these days. Biggest town I ever saw. I need to build more beds here. There's a lot of people. Very small settlement, though. Maybe build up. That might be an option. Just build up the way. Clearly Bedford Station. Injured mongrel. <laughs> what have we run into? My provisioners are under attack. God, look at all that blood. Too many miles on the road. At least the pay is terrible. Do you know what? I don't think. Old girl? That might be Lucas Miller's. Eh, whatever the case, he's not here, so. Let's go clear out Bedford. Where's <laughs> Kelly? I can buy another Brahmin. Woo! Sort that out anyway. Hey, I got a question for you. I've got a really mm -hmm. top tier piece of cow flesh for sale. Someone if you know what I mean. Perhaps they are Let's do this. <laughs> this case is so violent. Hey. Oh, hey. Did you think it over and change your mind? Sure. I'll take her. Oh, great. Great. Just tell me where you want me to. And we'll send this one over to County Crossing. Good doing business with you, man. I believe there's 
supposed to file a police report, yes? And all the little sins going back is for evidence. You can see. Oh, the dead drop respawned. Nice. Let's go report our success. I know they're radiant ones, but they get us some XP, which we do need. Took care of those ghouls that were giving you trouble. You did? That's great news. Okay. You know what? We'll do Curie's next one. Um, I just want to go about and tell everyone great news, great successes. Let's talk to Preston. What on earth? Is he like walking back from the castle? Preston seems to be on the move. I'm not sure why. But whilst I'm here. We're open for business again. A little lighter. Let's see what you have. A little bit of everything. I just want that one unique weapon that I most certainly need off you, Trudy. Anything else? Whilst I'm here, longshoreman outfit. Nah. Hmm. Wait, what was your shipments? I'll take wood. I'll take concrete because I'm always building that up. Yeah, it'd be silly if I didn't take those two. I'm going to need to do some serious investing in my settlements. Might have to start doing the building sooner rather than later just to get them built up. Now, I am going to just hunt down Preston because he's trying to run away from me. He's at Rocky Narrows Park right now. I don't know where and I don't know what he's up to, but if he's just wandering the Commonwealth, I mean, that's fair enough. Do you think he'd at least tell me before he decides to go wandering off? Never turn down the wicked shipping trailers. They're awesome. Love collecting them, to be fair. Uh, did I pick up the armor here? I should have. No, I didn't. Hmm. I'll have to come back for that. Uh, I need to catch up with Preston, so I'll grab that armor too. Beside the Drumlin Diner, so I thought he was going back to somewhere, but he must just be wandering. Oh. The only thing we are concerned of in here is the Something really heavy. Serious? Oh no, God, wait, no. 
that's okay. Aston, where are you and what are you doing? What are you doing? I cleared out the ghouls that were giving that settlement What's he trouble. Doing out here? Glad to hear it, General. It's hard enough out here without people having to worry about ghouls in their backyard. I'll let you know if I hear of it. In the meantime, make sure to... Hey there. Is there something you need? How are you feeling? I'm glad to have the chance to return the favor. Just let me know if there's... Uh-huh. Who's out? Oh, it's a provisioner of ours. Ah, good to see us. Hmm. Don't ever remember seeing these ruins before. Oh, this little dirt path. Runs all the way to the back of Grey Garden. What left in this area? No, the robot workbench. Okay, those are all easy things. There's Curia, of course. There's finding Virgil. There's getting that grenade. Just silly things. Missed getting the vault. Warwick. We'll complete it by just talking to Warwick. Okay. And tell them all the good news. They need to hold their applause. I knew you would help us. Can't wait to get them as part of the thing while the potatoes are growing, though. Well, you're still alive. That either means you haven't gone after those super mutants yet, or good news. Just a hired hand doing a job. Those super mutants won't be bothering say. you again. I guess you were the right person for the job, huh? Woohoo! Thanks, friend. By the way, we've decided to support the Minutemen. We've got to help each other if we want them. Good, good. Okay, you're now my settlement. This is fantastic supply lines okay i need you to connect to the castle i need the castle to connect to nordhagen or something hmm hangman's alley maybe over to here maybe use the castle as we connect them point yeah i'll have to work that out but that pretty much concludes this one brilliantly enough Up here before, so. Uh -huh. mm, nope, nothing. Nothing strange or startling up here. If there's anything in the water. Hmm. Nope. Piqued my curiosity. And then dropped it from a height. What about this one? Is that a baseball bat? Maybe just a standard one. Anything else? I don't know, the last bit of this episode is me just floating around the water to see if I can find anything. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be anything here. <laughs> it wasn't let me swim there, it was just let me walk on this. Just walk about. All right, we did good. We have done good. Need to connect up all these settlements, though. Need more clean black suits. I know just where to find some too. Off I go to the Skylands. See you all in the next one. Thank you for watching.